here we go. The version 15 of Angular is available and I decided to upgrade our project to the latest version. As you know, inside our project, we are using version 13 of Angular. If you started this course recently, I think that your project is already up to date because you already downloaded the latest version. But if you didn't, you can follow this tutorial. In this lesson, I want to upgrade both front-end and back-end packages to the latest version. So let's go. For updating the packages, you can use npm update that is built in inside the npm. But the problem is it will not upgrade the major version. It will upgrade the minor version and patch version. So if we want to update our Angular to the version 15, we cannot use npm update. But there is a package that will do it for us. It is npm check update or ncu. I will tell you how. First of all, from the terminal menu, select new terminal and install npm check updates as a global package inside your computer. So write npm install dash g npm dash check updates then press enter so it will be installed as a global package inside your computer now that we installed it as a global package we just need to go to the front end project and write ncu that is a shorthand for npm check updates and press enter it will automatically check if there is any updates for your packages inside your package.json as you can see it will log a lot of items for every single packages inside our project that your current version of the package could be upgraded to this version now that we know that we have new updates for our packages we just need to write ncu-u to upgrade our packages so just write ncu-u this time instead of showing us a log it will automatically upgrade the package.json here we go as you can see all the packages are upgraded and it suggests us to use npm install to install newer versions but since we have ng star rating that is not completely compatible with the newer versions of angular we need to install them by force again. So write npm install dash dash force, then press enter. Okay, now that all the packages are upgraded, we just need to write ng serve dash o to serve our Angular project. But we have an error. It says cannot get a slash. If we come back here, it says fail to initialize Angular compilation. It says that the Angular compiler requires TypeScript bigger than or equal 4.8.2 and less than 4.9.0. So it means we cannot have the latest version of TypeScript that is 4.9.3 for the Angular. The best fix for this is finding the TypeScript inside the dependencies. Here it says it should be bigger than or equal to 4.8.2. So the first thing that we do is changing this 4.9.3 to 4.8.2. First of all, save the package.json. Now the easiest solution for reinstalling the npm package with the changed version is removing the node modules folder and going to the terminal and writing npm install dash dash force again. Now, once again, we just need to write ng-serve dash o, but this time we will see something. That is our Angular front-end project. The reason that it doesn't work because we didn't run the back-end project. But before running it, I want to upgrade the back-end too. So let's do it. So close the front-end folder and open the back-end folder. And here on the terminal, open a new terminal. Go to the CD back-end folder and write ncu-u. While this is running, I close the package JSON of front-end and I will open the package JSON of back-end. As you can see, all the packages are updated to the latest version. But here on the back end, we don't have the limitation of front end because on the front end, all the Angular packages are dependent to a specific version of TypeScript. Here we can only write npm install without force because we are not using any special package here. Now that everything is installed, we just need to write npm start to run our project. As you can see, it says website served on localhost 5000 and the database is connected successfully. Now we just need to go to the browser, 
refresh the page and boom we have our project but all the packages are up to date